right, guys. What's going on here? <laughs> oh, I was going to ask them that I'll turn it off. Well, that's got some heat. <laughs> Nothing guys, how are you doing? Back on the road again. Ho oh, ho ho, let me tell you today, right? The van's on, we're ready to rock and roll because I'm giddy for this one. We're in Leeds, we're in the city centre, we're in the heart of Shieldenville, right where the unis are, right? Straight across from a pub called Library, it's packed out, right? It is Saturday night. Hey up, Paul! Saturday night, the time's all right, all right. We've come out a bit later than usual. Hopefully we're going to get a bit of light because I want to go to Meze Swarma. Now, this little shop apparently is knocking out little boxes of kebabs, big fat kebabs in Nambreds. Kebab it, kebab it, I'm going to have it. So let's go, let's see what's going on in Meze. See if it can fill my belly up. Caravan, I am starving. Woo! And here we are. Ho, ho, ho. Meze Swarma. Right, let's get part up. Boom, boom, it's going to bang it here. Uh, this won't be too long, come on. I can't see many people being out and about. There's a kid there, look, he's hugging him and he's thinking, I want to go for the Meze Swarma. Right, let's go, let's get part up. Let's see what's happening. And let's go, fill my belly up, come on. Whoa! <laughs> right, guys, we are off. So we're here, we're in Lee City Centre, we're at Meze Swarma. Let's get table and chair out. Do you know what, I can smell it already. It smells absolutely amazing. I don't know if it's that, if it's Chinese, it could even be barbershop. He could go for air cutting, cameraman. Now you could do with a trim. Whoever did yours last time, he's had a right laugh, that lad. <laughs> and eh, eh, I'd, I'd go get your money back. Right, let's have a look here. Bosh, whoosh. Eh, ba bum ba bum It's looking good here, isn't it? Eh, we can sit here, get some kebabs. Might even, might even let you have one. Right, cameraman. We're locked up, we're ready to rock and roll. Let's go. Oh, let's go, cameraman. Hey, it's full. It's full, there's nobody in. <laughs> it's full, there's nobody in. There's loads. I'm gonna go get your hair cut there. Might get a better job done. Right, here we go. Come on, let's go inside and let's see what's happening. Oh, oh, here we go. Oh, that smells amazing. I love you, right? I'm very well, thank you. Yourself? Oh, it smells good in here. Look at the size of that. What's that? So that's the chicken shawarma. Is so it? It's one of our most popular. That chicken looks like chicken. it'll just do for me. That yeah. cameraman, doesn't it? <laughs> that is yours. It's even got a little crowns on top. Right. So I've come down to try out. People have recommended that I come down and try out that's your right. kebabs. And apparently you do a, a big one. Yeah. So what's that about? What is it? It's called King Mix and Grill. It's one of our most popular is it? on our menu as well. It's on that picture as well. All right, so yeah. what, what do you get on that? So you get a mix of the different uh, types of charcoal with either rice or chips and yeah. salad as well. Right. Yeah. I'll have one of them then, please. Yeah, do, sure. do you get any naan bread at all with that? Yeah, we already Lebanese bread. What do you get what, sorry? Lebanese bread. Lebanese bread. Yeah. Oh, yeah. now we're talking. And do you get sauces with that yeah, as well? Everything. Yeah, I'll have one of them then. Yeah, How sure. much is it? Yep, yeah, and can I get a, a bottle of water as well, please? Yes, yes, Is that everything? That's it, thank you. Thank you very much. So, I'm just going to take a seat outside, yes, if that's sir. all right, yeah? Yes, sir, we'll over for you. No worries, thank you. Cheers, guys, See thank you. you. See you in a bit. You. Right, come on, come on, let's go get sorted out. Like that. <laughs> right, guys, uh, this uh, looks amazing. There's a massive picture on the wall of this big fat kebab. I am having that. I am having that bad boy. Right. <laughs> it looks like, come on, to be honest, it's 20 quid. So <laughs> is it going to be worth 20 quid? I don't know. The picture says that it does. Or suggests that it does look like it's worth 20 pound. Now, summertime, let me tell you, you cannot move on here summertime. I've been past here. I know this place here, if I remember right, they used to do chicken wings for a quid. After Covid, when it first opened up, for students, chicken wings, bought, I think you got three or four chicken wings for a pound. Eh, come on. Right, knack a cracker, get it away. Hey, oh, what's that? My little pink string, so I don't lose my keys. <laughs> pink to make the girls wink. Eh, there you go. Right, <laughs> chair test. Sound a bit of an ill here, come on. We end up flying down. But tell knacker cracker away. Right. I should have asked him how long. What could have gone for me haircut? Look at straight of it. Is it cold? 
Infinity Barbers. They could have given me a bit of a trim, couldn't they? Got rid of my greys. Like I said, you'll get yourself in. Him that did yours last time. <laughs> oh, what it butcher? You you'll go see my mates. <laughs> What's all this going on here? Oh, it's not on that Otley run, is it? There's people dressed as 118, man. They're all dressed as 118, man. They've got tashes on, black wigs, white t-shirts, red shorts. I don't know what's happening. Getting chilly now as well. Uh, up to now, right, and, and this is where I'm probably going to jinx this. We haven't done too bad with weather. It's not been that that bad, has it? But I'm reckoning over the next two months, it's going to get a little bit colder. Uh, I can be weatherman. We're going to get that breeze coming in from east. It's going to start going across straight over to the west and then it's going to go down south, flip back up and go north. <laughs> I don't know how you be a weatherman. I'll have to go on with, with him. Oh, Christine, Duncan and John. They know, they know weather. They get them back on. They've done with calendar. We'll get them on here doing weather and news. <laughs> there must be some kind of fancy dress. If I didn't know they were fancy dress, I'd have got dressed up. You know me, I'm up for out. Let's ask somebody. Let's ask somebody. What's going on? There's one more, eh? We missed a trick here, cameraman. You could have got dressed up. It's all going on. Woo! Yeah, right, guys, what's going on here with 118? Is it fancy dress? Well, if I'd have known, I'd have come dressed like that. Yeah. Woo! How are you doing, all right? Oh, it's cold, isn't it? Right, so, big mezze armor box, chicken swarmer, donna meat, loads of stuff. We're here, look. Is that your real hair? <laughs> if I'd have known that you were all dressing up like this, I'd have had a cut. It's Otley Run. Oh, Otley Run. Yeah, 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 this yeah, is yeah, it. This well, is she's it. bought t shirt off TV. You've just coloured I've, yours I've in. Yeah, it you've been to Tazden and got. See, he's bought his and you've just gone to Tazden and got pens out, haven't you? Nothing. Yeah, yeah. If you want to give it to him, he'll take it for you. Thank you very much. We're all here. Yeah, we're all in. Cheers. Thank you very much. Where are you off now then? Uh, well, next, this the That's the next one. Take library. Yeah. yeah. I, I like you. Uh, bit of Fanta. Squeeze a lime. <laughs> I'm going to that Mizze Mes Schwammer up corner here. So it's a, it's a nice little place, but apparently people are saying that he does a big Mizze box. And apparently he's banging it. it, it so, well, I'm going to give it a go. I'm gonna give it a try, see what it's like. Yeah, yeah. Well, don't get too drunk, eh? Ooh. <laughs> how, how long have you been on run? This is our fifth pub. Is that it? Your fifth pub, and you're not legless yet? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I tell you, when I were your age, I'd have been absolutely blasted by six pubs. You're not doing it right. You're not doing it right. Uh, pint and three shots. Start that off. Go on. <laughs> Hey up mate, how are you doing? Oh you? Yeah, are you gonna be on? Where have you come from, barbers? What happened to you there? Thought it's one bad Jesus. <laughs> Go see my barber, my Jeff, five quid. <laughs> Alright. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks mate. See you later, mate. Yeah, of course you can, you alright? Jump in. How you doing mate? Yeah, right, mate. Good, what what are you up to today? Uh just going there. Are you going for your hair cutting? Yeah. I'm losing out here. Everybody's going for their hair cutting. Is this a good? Haircut? Just there. Yeah, that's what I like to hear. I'm telling you. Told you. What I, time's I, your appointment? Uh, 445. It's with me, isn't it? With you? Yeah, yeah. Why do you have appointments? Yeah. Because I, I said to him, he's been for his hair cutting. I said, whoever did his, he needed to come to you guys. Because whoever did his, I scalped him. <laughs> <laughs> Man, it's been a long time since we've done one this late as well. You know, in, in winter time, I'm falling asleep. When it when it's winter, do you find you go to bed early? I'm always off to bed early, me. Uh, oh, I'm looking forward to this though. I've been waiting all day for this. I got up this morning. I went for a swim. Had my bowl of porridge. Did my exercise regime. I did 50 laps at football pitch. <laughs> now you know I'm lying. It is you. I swear it's usually rocking around here. <laughs> Sorry. 
Paul, how are you doing? Good, mate. Good. What are you up to? Bit of uni work. Yeah. I'm going to that Meze Swammer up corner here. Is it good? Yeah, because a lot of people have recommended it. Arabian wraps. Arabian wraps. Yeah. Tasty. Yeah. Oh, good, man. Cheers, Paul. Have a good day, mate. Ah, see, see, Arabian wraps, Arabian wraps. Oh, wow! Get this one. I just would like to give you about um, our menu. So yeah. here is the side orders. Here is Arabic style, which is like chicken wraps. We slice it in a few pieces. Here's the grilled chicken uh, kebab, yeah. la chicken kofta, lamb kofta, uh, lamb bread. Uh, lamb cube wow. and wings and here's some of our special uh, hot meza which is falafel all right but, uh, chickpeas and vegetables oh halloumi cheese some special sauces homemade all and right some lebanese bread as well thank you very Hope much you can i get me a bottle of water as well please yes, thank you very much wow so guys look at this i'm not well this is a meal for a fat man isn't it <laughs> to be fair 20 quid the size of that look at the meat on that uh, I've never seen so much meat in my life when I look down. Wow! We've got aloumi cheese on here as well. Little pickled peppers. Garnished with carrots. Tomatoes, lemon. But that rice looks good. Chips with a bit of chip spice. These look case. Homemade sauces. I don't know what that one is. That looks like some kind of uh, coconut sauce, like a bounty. Right, and Lebanese bread. Here we go. Thank you very much, though. Thank you. Thank you. What a lovely lady. Nice big smile on her face. Right, what we got here? Vivat, spring water. May he or she live long. There you go. I love it when they put these little signs up on water bottles. Right, let's wet the whistle and let's get tucked in. Oh, I'll tell you something, that bread looks good. <laughs> so, I don't know why they fetched out two, two spoons and two forks. There's not enough here for you. <laughs> right, let's get into chips. Use my fingers. So, we'll start off with chips. Oh, nice and crispy fries. Oh yeah, nice bit of, hey, do you know what? Oh, they're nice, they are. Got a nice crisp to them. I can tell they've been cooked in a clean oil. Nice bit of chip spice, absolutely spot on. Right, let's get some rice. Oh, here we go. Hi. Hey, love you, alright? Yeah, are you? I'm very well, thank you. Really. I'm burning my mouth for you. So, uh, I saw you on live the other day with my friend. Oh. I'm um, Sarah, the makeup artist, friend oh. of Sophie. All oh, right, yeah, she needs some makeup, doesn't she? <laughs> no, <laughs> I'm she kidding, I'm going to kill me now. I just saw your van, so. All oh, right. Come yeah, nice what to meet you. you. I've got. So, I've been to that Mese Schwama on the corner here. Massive, massive. Oh, here we are. I've got baby wipes. Hey, you don't get that, do you? Look at that. <laughs> it's just got chicken swarmer wraps, chips, rice. There's uh, like a skewered chicken there, skewered lamb, kofta's, right. lamb chips. Oh, there's loads. It looks tasty. Twenty quid, isn't it? I'll have to go sometime. Yeah, yeah. It's nice to meet you. Yeah. Really nice really to meet you. Nice to meet you. <laughs> All right, love. Bye. See you soon. Oh, there you go. Look, that looks like I'm going to get dirty. That. Right. That's so all. That rice. Let's go back to the rice. So that. There you go. Now, look, how you doing, pal? Where have you come from, barbers? <laughs> have you? What are you yeah. laughing at? Yeah, do you want some? No, I'm all right. <laughs> there you go. All right, mate. Nice to meet you, pal. Right. So, how are you, mate? All right? Yeah, can I? Yeah, of course you can. Thumbs up. Way. <laughs> there you go. How are you doing, pal? Have you just had your hair cut? Everybody's coming out at barbers. Know, yeah, eh? yeah, I've told him he should have gone for his look at state of his hair. Josh King in there, mate, that's yeah. where it's at. Is that what it is? I'm, I'm missing a trick here. It's flattering off, that, isn't it? Yeah, that, it, that's, that's a beast, that, mate, isn't it? I'm just starting to tuck in, so I can't wait. Have a nice one. All right, pal. Right, I'm going to get some of these chips. That rice, cooked to perfection, nice and soft. And it's got like a... Got a nice bit of paprika, a bit of chilli in there. <laughs> it's got a right nice little taste to it, to be fair. Right, let's see what these dips are. Oh, just brought my chip in that. These are homemade dips. Oh, wow. I'm having that bit. That's a tzatziki sauce. So I don't know what this one is, because it looks a bit like a like coconut. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, 
it's a bit like a mayo, like a thick mayo that. And then we've got chilli. Well, I think it's chilli. But the, the consistency of these are a lot different to any sauces I've ever had. Yeah, that's a chilli, so that's a chilli, that's a mayo. Wow, that's got some heat. <laughs> but they're more like a chutney. So, this is a big box, guys. So being in an area full of students, I can see why this is popular. Right, I'm just going to work my way my way down it like this till we get to this end here so this is the chicken shawarma wraps so you've got a full wrap there chopped up nicely it's got a nice bit of crisp to it smell oh, oh, oh that smells good so this is what what on that big spit not bad mate how are you all right so far i've tried the chips and the rice so far mate so good it's it, it's it's tasting good but it smells banging looks all right doesn't it yeah yeah so it is looking good cheers mate thank you right let's get into this chicken shawarma in a wrap this one the big one that we're on the spit oh wow oh my god oh come on guys this is moist tasty I can taste a bit of right aniseed coming through. Bit of ginger, the spice on this. Oh my god. That on its own would just be a winner. Right. Garnish with a bit of onion. Oh, got a tag no onion. Hello me. You know me. <laughs> I love hello me. Squeaky cheese as I call it. Let's get in a bit of tzatziki. Oh. oh, guys, that is absolutely squeaky cheese time on my teeth. Wow, wet my whistle. Cameraman, you're getting some of this because I don't think I can eat it all. Right, I'm going to try a little bit of chicken. So, this is the chicken skewers, chicken kebab. Look at that. Oh, marinated. This line here, guys, that is just coming apart. Wow, it's got the charcoal flavor. Now, bear in mind, I'm comparing this to that one in uh, it, that Venus so far. <laughs> I'm telling you, right? So, this is the I think this is the chicken sheesh. We'll break some of this off. Whoa, look at that. So look at all the flavouring in there. Oh. Oh, cameraman, can you smell it? He's nodding. This, right? <laughs> you can... Wow. Oh, my God. I have never tried a shish kebab like that in my life. Wow. Soft. It's not grisly. The herbs and spices running through this are just absolutely immense that is a bit of me grilled tomatoes look <laughs> i'm gonna have to try a little bit just to get give it a go but nice charred up tomato it's all in one this one put a bit of sauce on it part of me five a day oh look wow so it's also you've got bread there and it's also Saved on bread. I didn't see that. So there's bits of bread underneath. <laughs> Let's pull a bit out. Let's pull a bit out. Let me get a bit of this chicken in here that we've already had. I'm going to try a bit of this bread with this chicken. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm saying it twice because I've got this beautiful chicken wrap. I think there's loads of people in shell suits heading towards me. Don't know what's going on. Bit of chilli. Ah, oh, I was going to ask them, they're all turning off. That bread. Mm. Let's go to bread. So this is the Albanian bread. So it's a bit, it's thin. Absolutely gorgeous. You can wrap this round. It's a bit like the wrap. It tastes amazing. It's not as dense as a nan bread. Right. Oh, <laughs> cameraman. So this will be the lamb kebab. 
Oh, oh, look at that. So again, it is full. You can see on it, it has been mixed up the meat, formed into these skewered patties. <laughs> it's got little bits of veg and what have you in there. Oh my God. Stick a fork in me, I'm done. Wow. That beautiful flavour of lamb coming through. This one, it's not as spicy as the other one. It's quite mild, but it's got a really, really nice flavour. But again, soft, succulent. Sometimes with cheese kebabs, they can dry out, can't they? I can't believe it's getting it baby wiped out. Knock my nose a little bit. Get rid of that one. Right. <laughs> there is some food here. This is definitely a platter to share. It is not one for you to sit down on your own. There is so much here. Too much here for one person. Right, so this is the falafel. Let's have a go at this. Look at this. Oh, so it's nice and crispy. So deep fried chickpeas. This falafel. I'd never had this un until I started doing rate my takeaway. And now. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Now, I quite like it. Oh, wow. Right, I'm slowly getting down this. What's this? A bit of foil on. <laughs> so this is a, like a, is it like a chop? Do I eat that bit? What's going on? Why have they put foil on the end? Let's have a look. I'm investigating now. Bone on. It is, it's like a bit of a chop. Oh, wow. That is absolutely gorgeous. That lamb chop, absolutely bang on. Nice bit of charring. Again, the flavouring that they're managing to get on this meat is absolutely next level. Then you've got chunks of lamb here. Look at this. So chunks of, oh, oh, here we go. Is it going to be tough? Pulls apart like it might be, but let's give it a go. No, it's not bad, actually. It's quite easy to chew. I thought it was going to be a bit tough. That's all right. Again, the flavour that they've got into it. Wow. Wow. Right. Let's do chicken wings. So what's left now is just chicken wings. There is a lot of meat. I would go to far to say, if you were having just a little lunchtime snack, you could probably share this between four of you. Bit of a wrap each, few chips, bit of rice, little bits of meat each. And then you've got, what, four or five chicken wings on there. There's loads of bread. You've got your dips. <laughs> Bologna cheese, value for money, it's bang on. So we've got chicken wings. Looks like they've been done on grill. Look at that. Oh. Oh. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. The flavour. That charcoal barbecue taste. Oh. Guys, just comes off the bone. They are brilliant. But I've got to say, out of the whole platter, I'm quite surprised. This has surprised me. The chicken sheesh. That is amazing. Full of spices. I can taste ginger in that. That is bang on. The chicken swami. Right, let's go through it. Wow. So, 20 quid for this massive platter, right? You've got chips, nice, beautiful, crispy chips. You've got some beautiful, fragrant rice there. It's got a nice little bit of a, a paprika, chilli flavour to it. Nice and moist, bang on, right? Then I moved on to these swami wraps. That chicken swarma is absolutely divine. Soft, succulent, full of flavour, absolutely bang on, all right? To be honest, it's probably one of the best swarmas I've had. Then the chicken kebab, which is just here, I'll move that lemon. I was worried, like the lamb, that could it? Of course you can, mate, of course you can. How are you doing, all right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Have you been to this place? No, uh, I've never been to this place. One up corner, Mezze Swarma, yeah. Is it good? Mate, that is beautiful. Do you want out? No, no, I'm all good, mate. Yeah. Cheers. Nice one, pal. Take care, mate. Yeah, you too. 
So I was worried that the chicken might be a bit dry because sometimes these skewered chickens are. But that, the flavour on it, right, it got a, the smokiness of the charcoal grill straight through the chicken. Absolutely gorgeous. Got a beautiful coating on it. Get a little tingle on my tongue. Bang on. This cheese kebab here, that's done me. I can taste a little bit of ginger in there. It's a flavour that I've never experienced before, that one. And I, I, I have loved it. I've loved every second of it. Right, we moved on. We've got halloumi here. I bet they won the other side. But halloumi, it's always a winner with me. I love it, deep fried halloumi. This has been grilled up a little bit. Absolutely gorgeous. You've got dotted about onion and tomatoes. But then I moved on to the lamb sheesh. Again, wow. Different flavour to that one, it's not as strong and potent as that one, but you've got the flavour of the lamb coming through. Again, nice and soft. The spices that are in there just give a little bit of a tingle, not too much. It's very tasty, very tasty. That inside this beautiful Algerian bread, who well, I'm not too bothered about greenage, let's get that off. <laughs> I've had my five a day with tomato and onion, but this Algerian bread with that in and a bit of this sauce, I mean, I think this is some kind of homemade mayo and it's amazing is that fresh and i quite like this bread it's it's, a, it's not a chapati it's different than a chapati it's nice then what's gone from here <laughs> something's gone have i ate something from there cameraman what were there oh lamb chop I think there was a big gap there, I must have enjoyed whatever that was. So that was lamb chop, beautifully cooked, nice bit of fat on it, which I like. All right, seasoned up well, beautiful. The bits of lamb, I was worried that were gonna to be tough. When I pulled them, it was quite tough to pull apart. But then once it's in your mouth, when you're chewing through it with your teeth, it was quite easy to get through. And again, cooked well, full of flavor. You've got a bit of falafel on there. The falafel, deep fried, tasting great, beautiful flavor to it, absolutely amazing. Then I moved on, I've got chicken wings, do not grill. I love chicken wings when they're cooked right and they are cooked perfect for me. Absolutely bang on. So guys, with the homemade dips, 20 quid, I think it's well worth it. All right, I can see why people said, Dan, come try this out. Because some of the flavors on here, there's no grease on it. It's absolutely gorgeous. There's more bread under here with all the veg that's there. So you can make up a few kebabs if you wanted. I think it's value for money. So, if you've been to Meze Schwama, let me know what you think. If you've not been, come down, check it out, let me know. But for me, guys, you've sent me to another place where I can do nothing but give it a nice solid 10. Absolutely bang on. I'm going to have a chicken Schwama. I'll see you later. Oh, my God, cameraman. You need to get tucked into this. There's a bit of stuff in here as well, like a bit of a... I think there's that mayo and seasoning. Oh, there is, look. Wow.